Hi everybody, I wanted to make a really quick video for you guys regarding an issue that I've been having for quite a while. This issue is regarding my trash right down here in the lower right hand corner. The problem was I had some contents in there I could not get rid of. It was super frustrating and there was nothing I could do. I went on the internet of course to try and do my research what I could do. I tried typing in sudo commands in my terminal app which is in your applications folder for Mac OS X. I've tried restarting of course many times hoping that that would do it. Of course I didn't think I had anything special going off my computer I don't delete anything that's special why would I have a special problem you know what I mean so I was hoping restarting would definitely fix it if not this would definitely fix it as it claimed to help many many other people with the same issue I've even download apps like this trash it app which is free um, you can download it as well off the internet and try it out if you have stubborn items in your in your trash uh, what this does is it pretty much does pseudo commands for you in your terminal so you don't have to. It's the same thing though. Uh, neither worked for me. I did everything besides cleaning out my computer totally and starting from scratch. I did not want to do that. Not that I have anything on here worth saving really. But I just thought, you know, why start over if I don't have to? And over a month of struggling with this, I thought I might have to. I even went to Disk Utility, which is what I usually did, uh, do at my computers, you know, way back when. I just go to Disk Utility and do you know, repair permissions and first aid and every volume that I had thinking that would help. I talked to a Mac guy before and he told me that didn't really do anything, but I did it anyway for peace of mind. I tried that now on this MacBook Pro, which is not too recent, but you know, within a few years, it did help. Uh, it didn't do too much because they took away a lot of the features in disk utility. Um, so I tried that once and didn't really do anything. So I let that go. Um, so what I ended up doing today, after a long while of being frustrated by this problem, I was determined to finally fix it. I didn't know how, but I was going to restart my computer and start everything over again if I had to. I restarted my computer, held down the Command and an R button on my keyboard. And what happens is the Apple logo comes up. You can let go at that point. A certain menu comes up. And the menu is uh, allows you to do disk utility. You can start from scratch. You can reinstall OS X. You can do lots of different things. There's like four different options you can try. Try there. Um, I didn't want to start everything over just yet. So I tried Disk Utility again. Like, oh, I never saw that that was there. This is kind of a cool option. So um, the Disk Utility looked a little different than what I tried on my desktop right here, guys. So when I did Disk Utility, there was all these volumes that showed up. Things like um, if you have external hard drives plugged into your computer, your your also your internal hard drive, also this base IQ thing. This is a flash drive I have connected to my computer if you're looking right here in the right hand side of my screen. Uh, this is just a flash drive I have installed. You can look it up and see what I bought here. I just installed it to increase my memory. Um, so all these volumes are showing up on computer, which is fine. I did first aid. Immediately a plus green shows up, which means uh, it's like a check mark saying everything's good in your computer. Great. So I did it to all my volumes until I did first aid and base QI. And then a negative thing comes up with an, and a red sign, a very ominous red sign pops up saying, hey, your base QI, there's something wrong with it, right? I'm not a computer expert, but I'm guessing something's wrong with it. So I kind of was surprised that something could be wrong with this. This is nothing more than a flash drive. So what I did was I erased all the contents on it, and then I guess it repairs a permission on this, um, and then I did first aid again, and then it was a plus sign, a check, green check button, which looked reassuring. Um, like I said, this is nothing more than a flash drive. What I did was I had some files on here, like a comedy album or something like that, and one day I dragged it off there and I put it into my trash bin. And then I tried deleting it and I couldn't. So th that's when the glitch probably happened because I haven't been able to get rid of it ever since. It'll delete anything or else around it, but it won't delete that one file, the permissions, and the the, it was locked and it was in use or whatever and I wasn't even using it I just I tried everything could not get rid of it finally I restarted my computer after doing the disk utility I did not reinstall OS X or anything like that and then when I restarted my computer I was able to delete my trash as you can see, you can see it's completely empty so it was very very happy day for me and uh, that was a pesky problem that I could not find a solution anywhere in the internet everyone else was uh, saying that pseudo commands and doing all these other things up here definitely worked but for me it did not work at all so if you have a problem like this it's most likely because you have an external hard drive that you bought that you're installing, and that there's a glitch there when you try deleting things off there on your computer. You know what I mean? So definitely check that out before deleting everything off your computer. I hope if you have a problem with this, this is your solution because 
no one was there to help me when I tried finding this problem out and uh, it was very frustrating so hopefully I can help you with your frustration in this matter thank you guys so much I am making another video with another problem I recently fixed that I hope can help you as well thank you very much I'll see you in the next video